Asalaamu Alaikum and welcome back to the favourite part of the show for me is celebrating British Bangladeshi success and again we start off at any age range and today we have Tahmid Ali, Asalaamu Alaikum You are 14 years of age Yes and your proud father is Noshad Ali, Asalaamu Alaikum Alaikum and uh, you have two sons Yeah uh, I think Tahmid is the older and you have a younger son who's 12 Yes uh, Welcome to the show Thank you. Yes. What we want to explain to the audience out there is that we're celebrating uh, the achievement of uh, Tahmid uh, in mathematics. Uh, he's a brilliant uh, mind in terms of mathematics. And what have you achieved? Uh, well, so far I have achieved a gold medal in the Junior Maths Olympiad, mm -hmm. which puts me among the top 30 among the whole of Britain. Okay, so have you applied for Menza yet? Or are you looking um, to apply soon? Looking to? Okay, so in, in terms of uh, mathematics, obviously uh, your future career yeah. will uh, be dictated by what you're good at now. You're good at mathematics. Yeah. Uh, languages, you speak uh, other languages as well, ap apart from English and Bangla? Yeah, I'm stu I currently study at school French and German. And I have studied before some Arabic, so as in the Arabic language itself. So that's kind of a valuable asset to me. Right. And very connected with mathematics are yeah. things like statistics, things like um, uh, physics as well. Yeah. Are you interested with the, those science type of subjects? Yeah, particularly physics. Brilliant. Do you watch the Big Bang Theory? Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's seldom, but I do, watch, I do sometimes watch it. Your f favorite character is? Mm. Can't say I have a favourite character. No, not Sheldon? Possibly, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, who doesn't like Sheldon? Noshad <laughs> uh, Bhai, it's a pleasure to have you on the show. You must be a really proud father. Thank you. Um, how did you manage to bring up a young man such as this to win the Maths Olympiad? Well, I um, give them time and uh, make sure that they are doing what they should be doing as well as playing what they should be doing at this age they are gaining knowledge they're doing their homework and also i make sure that they're going an extra mile they're doing some extra work extra mathematics and extra book study what I think all parents should do and look sure. after their children in this country. I have 11 plus Latimer School, which is one of the top uh, schools within the UK. I have 11 plus. 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 I have once I was did, made redundant, then by the I'm still late. Yeah, okay. By the I'm the audience so balas. No, no, balu. So I'm in a school or balak to offer for a private school of Islam. The private schools are by the I'm the size. It is school into Amra community manuscu home. Amra student to hold. Amra monogoran the private school of Gelu from rather be shadow bostro the Walakbo are. Ita to amra hoy to khew khew manor khew khew effort korta far ba bat khew khew manor amra far tam nae aar oto foy sha west korya lab nae. The ami dekhlam se shop shomai se dewa lagbo foy sha aar oto foy sha ye kora lagbo illa nae. Student of less scholarship paya bala bala student of less zairia aar ye kora. To amar brainu ailo se ami ek to eleven plus dekhlam je 11 o school o 11 plus test lo oito ami dekhlam je igula to ashole bachchai tore jodi ek bochor dui bochor ek tuk feedback dewa ek tuk help kora hoy te amrar bachchai tor je knowledge ache te tara palau farba acha kintu eto to thik obosho amra tahmid to bala eta result hoyre ari eta grammar school o dukson but onek manush ason jara amrar community ta ki tara comprehensive o pora lekha hoyre bala university te gesoin ebong bala babe result khorra the professional doctor of Bevshad Dukra. Afnar Zarahoito Grammar School of Dukto Farena, Zara Comprehensive Zo Asse, Zara O System of Gary Hoito, GCSE Dibo, Bobisho, A level Dibo, Nano Doroner qualification, Tara Hasil Horbo. It had a Kundorne advice Diba, the Comprehensive Asse, Ebon Kibabe E, result to maximize Horaza, outcome to maximize. Obviously, the Balai School of the Hali Grammar School of the ITG, Grammar School of Gelegu. Private school, like you say, Taraze, 
হান্ড্রেড পার্সেন্ট গ্যারান্টি বালা করবা আর যে কম্পিটেন্সিভ স্কুলও করতা নাই ইলা কোনো কথা নাই পেরেন্টস হলে যদি তারারে গাইড দিন আর তারার যদি তারারে লুক আফটার করোয়েন প্রপারলি আর যে সিলেবাস আছে সিলেবাস অনুযায়ী যদি তারা স্টাডি করোয়েন তে আমি দেখি না কোনো কোনো ট্রাবল আছে করে বাট মেইন জিনিস হইল গিয়ে পেরেন্টস হলে তারারে তারা যে ঠিক মতো খাম করানি ঠিক মতো তারার স্কুলর ওয়ার্ক করানি তারপরে আরও অনেক জিনিস আছে যেগুলা যেমন বাইচিন তোর মেন্টালি এফেক্ট করে যেমন আমরা অনেক সময় আছে আমরা লেট নাইট আমরা আজা গিয়া থাকি যাই বা চেন্টরে লইয়া আমরা আউটিং করি এ করি সে বারোটা একটা অনেক সময় ওই যায় এর বাদে বাদর দিন স্কুলে হুরুতে গিয়ে তারা কনসেনট্রেট করতে পারেন না তো কম্প্রিহেন্সিভ স্কুল ওইলো করি যে তারা যে টিচার হল টিচার হল কিন্তু কোয়ালিফাইড তারা পড়াই রা কোয়ালিফাইড টিচার হল তো এটা আমরা যদি একটু ইয়ে করি যেমন আপনি কইসই এটা এমন নাই যে এটা কম্প্রিহেন্সিভ স্কুল তাই গিয়ে আমরা দেখতাম পারছি অক্সফোর্ড কেমব্রিজও আমরা স্টুডেন্ট হল গেছই আমরা বালাও করছেন তো এটা প্যারেন্টসে যদি তারারে গাইড দিন আর ঠিক মতো লইয়া যায় তো অফকোর্স পসিবল তাহমেদ হাউ ইম্পর্টেন্ট ওয়াজ ইউর প্যারেন্টস গাইডেন্স ইন ইউর সাকসেস আই উড সে এক্সট্রিমলি ইম্পর্টেন্ট এন্ড হাউ ডিড দে গাইড ইউ হোয়াট ওয়াট ডিড দে ডু ইন প্র্যাকটিক্যাল টার্মস ওয়াও দে সো জাস্ট ওয়েন আই হ্যাড এন্ড জাস্ট পুশ মি দ্যাট এক্সট্রা বিট জাস্ট টু গেট মি এহেড সো দ্যাট আই ডোন্ট হ্যাভ টু থিংক সো মাচ अबाउट व्हाट আই এম ডুইং ইন স্কুল and so i can just use that extra knowledge and just boost myself right. just to get that mal perhaps another mal af- after because the difference between an a and a b is not great difference is there no uh, really. in terms of uh, your future obviously you're 14 so mm. you'll be looking to do your gcse's then hopefully do your a levels yeah. have you thought of universities that you're looking to go to mm, i'm looking to go to maybe oxbridge Um okay. I might go to uh, University College London. Right. There there possibly might be other options for me. So definitely Oxbridge or one of the Russell Group universities. Yeah. And in terms of a, a career, have you thought about what you might want to do? I might go somewhere into engineering considering okay. my love for maths and right. physics. So you want to solve problems. Yeah. Okay. I mean math- mathematics just to explain it to the audience out there is a language in itself. Yeah. It allows you to solve problems. It allows you to uh look at solutions. For mm. example, if you want to fly from uh London to Dhaka, yeah. mathematics does come into play. Uh, can you can you try and relate how mathematics actually helps with that process of flying an aeroplane from London to Dhaka. Well, if you were to fly an airplane, you'd have to get a pilot, but that pilot has to know how much how much pressure in the engine there is, how much thrust has to go, how far they have to travel of course, and how high the, the plane has to go. But all of those require significant calculations. If you fail one of them, you could be off. You could be off your airport by about possibly about a mile off, which would be quite a serious case. Okay. Youngsters out there are frightened of mathematics <laughs> put them at ease should they be frightened at maths no not really cuz when you think about it all that it is is just a language anyone can understand english might be something everyone can understand but maths is something truly everyone can understand it's just out there you don't have to think so much you don't have to figure out is this is this truly how you write 93 because it's just 93 mm. you don't have to put so much pressure into thinking i'm not entirely sure i've got that right but with maths it just it can just open up a huge field of areas jobs applicants you can just go to my son shahinur my mm. second child is doing uh, engineering he wants to become a chartered engineer um and again rather like uh, what you want to do he really enjoys the design aspect of it he's using technology in order to uh, help him with design testing and so on and he'll be going to cranfield to do a masters mm. do you think that engineering that you know of will change over the next 10 years so that what you need to do is much more be a visionary mm. as opposed to a hands on uh, mechanic Well it might do especially with technical technological advancements especially considering nowadays we've got computers that can handle most of the work for us mm. but now we've 
instead of just getting hands on doing the work, we've got to just figure out a broader array of what we're doing and actually get that design down onto paper. And things like uh, a lot of people use Facebook, a lot of people use social media. That is largely based on mathematics, isn't it? That's based yeah. on algorithms uh, and how different things are connected. Yeah. Uh, do you think people realize that? Not really nowadays, especially because interfaces like Facebook and other social media, they've just become so simplistic as though clicking the post button seems like an easy task, but in actuality, you've got to go through so many algorithms. And if you look even further than that, it's just, zero, it's just ones and zeros. So to figure out how to code that message saying, suppose you got a new kitten, to get to, suppose, your friends or your followers, that requires very specific detail into how it gets to the recipients. And in IT, it doesn't understand English. What it understands is binary code, yeah. which is uh, very much algorithm based. Yeah, it is quite difficult to get your ha head around because there are so many numbers but they can actually, when you think about it, they can be simplified and then when you realise what the algorithm does, you realise why did I not think of that before because mm. it gets to you eventually. So That's hopefully uh, Bahmid, you will make the next version of the iPhone. <laughs> um, yeah. Rashad, by, um as a proud father, obviously a lot of parents out there uh, are saying, you know, if my child studies uh, and becomes different to me, he'll lose our culture, he'll lose the way that we do things. What would you say to those people that perhaps are resistant in, uh, hesitant in, in sort of encouraging their children to study uh, away from their own beliefs and their own cultures? Do you think they can do this, both things at once? I don't think they should worry about it. Because I think what we should do is, <clears throat> at the same time, we encourage our children to um, study and work hard and get their full pot potential out. At the same time, amra tarar tarar amra culture ki tam obviously. Ar amra amra tarar ola bring up kortam. Erba deoi logya kota the amra zudil tarar ekhon zudil ekhon to world moving so fast. Amra world or loge thal mile ya solta moibo. Ar zudil ila kori na naeni amra. The way book it, Amra culture, Loyar take us at Ahmoko, to Amra culture, they uphold Horar Moto, Ila Amra new generation Tahtonai. To Amra culture, we Katam Tare, Tarare, Arbar Amra Tarare, Tara the potential as a bong the Avne is the Husun, the Dosbos or Bad, the world are changeable. So each angel look at Talmile Amra by Chentes with the Solta Farona, the Amra the culture, the Tahuida, Amra the beliefs, the Tahuida, Icterania, he level of Heraposito. Shutter and Amra Uba Chentori. Of course. Tahmid, uh, yeah. some of the best scholars uh, in the world, especially in mathematics, especially in science, yeah. have been from the Middle East, have been Islamic in background. Do you think there is an inconsistency between being brilliant at something and being a Muslim at the same time? There might be, but if you think about it, all you've got to do is get your head into into the game. You've got to think about what it is, that, what the task is at hand. Um, mainly the, on, the only reason why the Middle East is so, seems to be more advanced in mathematics is because they've just had these documents kept so that they, can, they know what they know and they can advance on from that. But it shouldn't stop anyone else, whether they're Christian, Jew, atheist, agnostic, it shouldn't just stop anyone else from believing they're pointless, they're useless, they can't do anything. Because if you can get that click in your head, you can, you can, just, go, you can just go and travel for miles. Mm. I think in Islam, the roots of Islamic uh, advancement has been based in mathematics. So the Arabic numeral comes from uh, Islam, sort of going back mm, yes. uh, within that time. A lot of to, uh, things to do with astrology, uh, to do with navigation and all of those things. There is a very fixated um, you know, heritage that we have that we don't often celebrate. So I'm sure um, you know, you're going to use your uh, Olympiad success. What is your next competition that you're looking to enter? I think, um, I think in February, March time, there is an intermediate maths Olympiad, which I, as far as I'm aware, is 
quite hard. I think it's harder than the one I've done, so I've got, I've got to really focus okay. this time. And the questions that you are asked, is it, is it sort of pure mathematics or is it, is it largely um, base level mathematics? What, what sort of questions are you being asked? Well, the idea is the United Kingdom Mathematics Trust, they try and devise these tests for pupils not only to apply their academic knowledge, but to think outside the box, just to figure out what, they're, what it is they're actually doing, rather than just doing mental arithmetic. Of course, mental arithmetic comes into that, but it tries to see how creative pupils are. So in actuality, I think it's more of a combination of both just pure maths and um, creativity. So there is an applied element in there as well? Yeah. Okay. And do you get to solve problems uh, within a given situation? Give us an example of a question that you had to solve. Mm, for instance, recently I've had to solve a sandcastle question, quite ironically, in which um, there are, the sandcastle consists of three cylinders, the, each cylinder getting progressively smaller, and, I have, and it's made out of 24 buckets of sand, and you have to figure out what the ratio of the radius of that bucket is to the uh, radius of the entire sandcastle. And uh, how long did that take you to solve? Well, it took me about about half an hour. Okay. It's a bit tricky to get my head around it. And was it something that you'd come across before? Um, well, I've come across circle questions before, of course, but because of how varied these questions are, I did. Um, I hadn't really come across a question like that one before. So you had to obviously cross-pollinate the idea because it was to do with perspective, it was to do with uh, size, it was to do yeah. with... You had to obviously think way outside yeah. the box. Because I had to go with geometry, proportion, ratio, and just basic volumes of shapes. So you, it's sort of just a cross between several areas of maths. Okay, and how do you keep uh, abreast of this? Uh, sort of thinking outside the box. What do you do in addition to your normal schoolwork? Do you take part in puzzles? Do you uh, look to look at uh, different things? Well, I quite, quite unsurprisingly, I suppose, like uh, solving Rubik's cubes because they're just, they're just fascinating in a mathematical concept, of course. But it's it shows it just shows you how to think outside the box when you know how to get it done because you realize it's something that can be seem really complicated can be quite easy for instance the rubik's cube can consists of 43 quintillion different possibilities which is a big number and is also a number that doesn't sound nice but every single state can only be solved in 20 moves or less so when you're thinking outside the box, box, you just got to think, is there a simpler way to do stuff? Because mm. often that's usually what happens. And how did you actually uh, learn that skill? How, how to deduce it to the lowest uh, common denominator? Well, it's sort of, it's sort of like casework, I suppose. Um, with solving a Rubik's Cube, you just break it up into different bits. In solving, mathemati in solving mathematical problems that can seem really challenging, you just break up the question, read between the lines, sort of like uh, comprehension skills. Okay, and have you, uh, how quickly can you uh, correct the Rubik's Cube? Well, uh, my fastest time is about 26 and a half seconds. Right. Which is, quite fast even though you can theoretically solve it in under five seconds which is demonically fast i suppose but it's to do with your physical uh, you know niftiness as mm. well as and how fast skill. you can recognize it right sort of like how fast you can recognize what the problem at hand is okay and what is your favorite film i suppose the matrix would be something that would mm. be quite up there I wouldn't say I have much of a favourite film, although I do uh, like Disney's uh, Wall-E, because it's just, because it's not, like most films nowadays are more about wordy, uh, word length, but you don't need to, you can actually put the volume, actually you can actually remove all the voice from Wall-E and you can still get the gist of it, it just feels like you don't have to try so much to just to understand the plot. It's just there, right in your eyes. Okay. Going forward, the yeah. British Bangladeshi community is very much like yourself. You're the uh, future of our community. Um, what 
contribution do you think you'll make to that community as you get older? Mm, this is a tricky question. I think what I, will, what I would do is I'd sort of get that creativity element out there just so that we can, like in maths, we can think outside the box and we can develop the community. Brilliant. Uh, Nushad Bhai, uh, of course, a proud father. Uh, fathers out there looking to get their children uh, you know, beyond that fear factor in doing well. Tara kiba be easy nishtat ayya engage with tavarba. Tara kiba be furutendire fora lekhar dik diari mondi tavarba. Sudo sudo zinish kiba be tarare encourage fora dayi bose. Babe tara ayya abar fora lekhat diari attention dayin. Ar fora lekhat ayki tarare nizar zibon da unno tavarta We've only got uh, 30 seconds left. Okay. Amrar bachin tore amra follow ilogi amra fear kori. Ar amra ekta in ekta concept ilogi zay auk GCSC. Amra desho takhte hote hoye. Acha metric fori kya auk? I start right from the beginning. I'm game start very early stage. automatic potential If you can put them into learning, then Tarar learning Inshallah, <laughs> Negative side as it can. Of course, Afne effort for Tafarin for Auka, very good. But parents or contribution ilogia, very important. Afne the Tafner by Chakoto to progress for every day, day to day Afner by Charpoti, Zudil Afner Monojuk Tahe, Ebong Afne Luyabu, Afne Shomo Edita, the Ita for Tafarin Zudil, the Orto Ilogia best. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Noshad Bai and Tahmed. It's brilliant to celebrate all of us to celebrate the success of Tahmid. Inshallah, he will do uh, well and go from strength to strength into the future and be a true ambassador of the British Bangladeshi community. Inshallah. Welcome yes. to the show, and it's great to celebrate your success. Thank you very much. Thank you. Afnara Zara Dehra, Afnara Dehra, live monthly show on Channel S, last Wednesday of every month, business to business. Amra Zezinishta E. Ongshotagi Dehla. Ito ilo gya ze fora lekha khoraitu ilie besh kichu lage na. Shama inno kisu understanding lage, parents their guidance lage. Parents their guidance ee na ize afna technical knowledge taha lag bo subject shum munde. Kintu afna sele me shathe jodhi ehtu boin, boya dekho in thar kita khorer, kita forer. Afna buza lagtu na kintu ehtu jodhi shoho jo kita khoro in. Almost as a friend, almost as a support. Ze kita khorer hai, tumar kunu khoshto onni. Kiba be shahajyo khor tambari. Tallo ke jodi boya yeh tuk relax feel khora ita varoin. Then thara ita ayya utcha hi toi bo. Aar hamar jodi shudu dab dein ba neglect khoroin. Je foro fori ka shomaya ille hoy to bala khorbone a result bala na khol le jodi tarre dab dein then ita afne successful ita nae. Aar onesh shomay o guidance to o shobse zoriri. Is a private school o dawala bo ba private tuition foran lagbo ita temon zoriri nae. Main jinishu le gya parent. Child engagement. The Afnar Zara Zara Desoin. I hope you enjoyed our program. It's the last Wednesday of every month. Afnar next month, Amra loge jori tui ba. Amra abar thinta segment ala formu, foila segment ala formu about business innovation, about getting involved in business, about thinking out of the box so that you can achieve transformational solutions. Amra second segment to discuss formu gyaari in relation to tax. Accounting and finance. Afnar zara bepshan maze aso in. Era kiba be maximum profit forget to rakta varoin. Minimum tax dewa lagye. Ebang third segmento like Tahmid will be celebrating the success of a British Bangladeshi. Who knows who that will be? But inshallah afnar amra loge roi ba. Amra loge shohojo kita khor ba. Ebang phone hoyre ari join hoy ba amra shod. Shamnir maashe dekhoi ba. Assalamualaikum.